Before I joined the Entourage, I was doing ten dollars to $12,000 a month. I'm now doing that every three days. My name is Lena Hughes, I run Bubbles and Brushes and we sell art kits. Before I joined the Entourage, I was running paint and sip events in Orange and Bathurst. I was running it virtually by myself. I had a few artists that I was working with, but I was working insane hours, I was working every weekend, um, and I was wanting to expand my business, but I didn't really understand how to go about it without completely running myself into the ground. I was completely burnt out. I was just, like, I'd get to the end of the weekend and I'd just want to just collapse in heat. And I felt like I wasn't really being present as a mum either because I felt like I had to choose either I can try to grow my business and run events on weekends or I can spend time with my kids. And there's no, there was no middle ground there and I was, I was exhausted and feeling really guilty. At the start of this year, I had started to think about how I could start moving into art kits. Reason being is I would get a lot of queries from people way out west or from other regions um, that I, knew I just couldn't physically get to. Um, but I really wanted to be able to have a way of still connecting with those people. So I was kind of softly exploring Zoom as a possibility to do events online. Um, and I was starting to curate a collection of photos and kits so that I could start doing it at some point this year. And I sort of thought, oh, would this idea fly or not? I'm not really sure. So I was, but I was so busy and overwhelmed by the events that I kind of thought that's gonna to have to sit on the back burner. So then when events were shut down in March, what I decided to do was really speed up that timetable and just, just do the art kits because that was really all I could do. What I've really learned with the Entourage is not only how to think bigger, but how to act bigger as well. Since joining the Entourage, the results have been almost immediate. So the week before I did the first Expert Roundtable Day, which um, we got to do via Zoom, I did about $3,000 worth of sales. And I was stoked. But then I did the Expert Roundtable Day. All I did for that day was marketing because I thought this is what I need. I understand my product. I have a rough idea of my vision, mission, values. What I need is marketing. I came off that so pumped. So I worked almost all night and then I worked into Friday as well to get my Facebook marketing up. And what I did, which I kind of thought was a, like, let's do this crazy thing where I take Orange and Bathurst off my locations and just go nationwide. And I thought, yeah, we'll just see what happens. I'll put a small budget towards it and we'll see. My sales exploded to the point that I had to turn the notifications off my app because it kept pinging. So the following week, after that expert roundtable day, I did $16,000. And I can attribute that to the expert roundtable day because I implemented that straight away and, I, and the results were like that. Last year, uh, financial year ending 30th of June 2020, I did about 160,000. Uh, if we keep going the way we are, I should expect to end 30 June 2021 with the revenue of about $2 million. I, I, it's, un, it's actually unbelievable to me. My team has grown enormously. What I really like about that is it, we can now actually grow faster and better and smarter because I've got the right people in place. This time a year ago, we were just starting to expand into Bathurst and just talking about that. And that was, that was the big, the big idea for the business was we might set up events in a couple of different Central West locations. Um, what we're actually expecting is by the end of this year, we will have a presence in the US market. So that's a huge shift from Central West New South Wales to the rest of the world. For me, the coaching has been incredibly valuable because it makes you accountable. And there's someone who's actually now also invested in the success of your business. And it's, it's kind of that just extra person kind of over your shoulder going, hey, did you actually, did you do that thing that we agreed you were gonna do? The thing I love most about the entourage is the community. So it's not just a community of entrepreneurs, it's a community where you are using the vision partners and the coaches 
and the entrepreneurs as well. But everyone has that background. Everyone has come from the same place and we're all kind of going in different directions, but we all have this central theme in our lives that our work is our passion. I think I have become a leader. I don't think I joined as a leader. I would recommend The Entourage to anyone who is looking for their purpose, looking for their tribe, and feels like there's something out there, there's something more for them. I think The Entourage is for people who believe they are capable of more, but they don't know where to start.